It's time to end this. This battle. And all the battles we've had until now! Hey! Pervy Sage. <sighs> Looks like you were sleeping well. <laughs> I guess I was pretty tired. However, it seems like your training went well. <laughs> You've managed to keep up with whatever I've thrown at you lately. <laughs> yeah, I really had some trouble at first, though. I think you might be ready to proceed to the next step. Next step? Huh? Wh what is it? Some new kind of training? Here. What's this? Prayer beads? Right. First put these around each of your arms and legs. What kind of training is this, anyway? Hey, slow down. Sealing Jutsu! Four limbs waiting seal! <laughs> Finished. So like I said, what kind of training is this? Oh! What's going on? Whoa, this is really heavy! All right, all right, quit flapping your gums already. I just added weight to those prayer beads using jutsu. Of course, not just any weight. Yeah, it sure is heavy, but what kind of training am I gonna do like this? Nothing special. Just keep doing what you've been doing. That will be your training. And now, as you gain a certain amount of power, the color of those beads will change. Eventually, they'll turn red to signify the end of your training. When they glow red, come find me, and I'll take them off. And once the weight comes off... What? What'll happen to me? 
you'll be exponentially more powerful than you are now. Oh, sweet! I can't wait to get started! Huh. I guess that's all I need to explain for now. Let's keep moving forward. There should be a village around here somewhere. We'll head there for now. All right, I'm going to give it my best shot. Ugh, these things are pretty heavy. Pervy Sage, this is that village? This is Tree Felling Village. There's a cave where you can mine high-quality crystals. Wow! Clash with the Black Shadow! The bond between parent and child! Huh? I hear noises coming from up ahead. So do I. Let's go check it out, Pervy Sage. on what you've got to do. You must fulfill your mission. I know. Hmm? What's going on here? This is... It's a ritual. A human sacrifice. Huh? Um, who are you anyway? <coughs> I live close to this village. Are you okay? You seem like you have a cold or something. <coughs> I'm fine, thank you. Don't worry. I'm just a little under the weather. Yeah, well, I hope you're okay. Um, anyway, what's this human ritual thing or whatever? It's a ceremony to offer human sacrifices to a demon living in the mountains here. Oh, you knew about this too, Burby Sage? It's pretty common knowledge, actually. He's right. And the girl there... <coughs> she's to be sacrificed in that cave. Hold on! Wait just a second! Sacrifice? So you mean... that girl over there? It's a one-way trip. Her duty is to forfeit her life to appease the demon. What's up with that guy? Hey, that headband. Who are you? My name is Naruto Uzumaki. I'm a ninja of the Hidden Leaf Village. I knew he was from the Leaf. But why is a ninja from the Leaf Village here? Do you Leaf Ninja have something you wish to speak to me about? Stop all this nonsense. You know sacrificing yourself won't change anything? There has to be another way! Don't go throwing your life away! Don't speak to me about what I must do. What? Hey! I have my own path I must follow. Don't try to get in my way. I have my own path to follow. Goodness, that was close. But the ritual was completed. The village can rest easy now. All right, everyone. That's all for today. <laughs> oh, boy. You shouldn't be jumping into things willy-nilly like that, you know? Yeah, but a human sacrifice? Come on, that's crazy! There is no other way. <coughs> no other way? This village survives by selling the crystals it mines from that cave down there. But a few centuries ago, a demon called Black Shadow started attacking folk here. Black Shadow? I see. 
So that's where this grisly ritual originated. Yes. The village chief then couldn't risk their only source of prosperity, the crystals. So according to legend, he offered Black Shadow a living sacrifice to pacify the demon. Every offering buys the village several years of peace, allowing us to prosper for a while. So, there's no other choice? No, that's not true happiness at all. Someone must be sad that girl is gone now, right? You people are all okay with that? <laughs> I'm gonna bring her back, and I'll take care of this black shadow while I'm at it! Pervy Sage, I'll be back, okay? Sit tight! Naruto, wait! Oh, good. But to fight! <sighs> what the heck was that anyway? Well, for now, I'll just have to stay on my toes and keep moving. Wait! <gasps> what have you come all this way for? I'm here to take you back! Make me repeat myself. I have my own way and destiny. Your father and mother, they're worried about you. Everyone's worried about you. We shouldn't just blurt things out like that. What? My father, he passed away a long time ago. And now, my mother. She's about to leave this world, too. Wait! Hold on a second! What do you mean she's about to leave this world? Uh-oh. Looks like I've got to take care of these guys first. Man. What a waste of time! <sighs> I'm telling you to wait! How long do you plan to follow me around for? Till you agree to come back with me! You're wasting your time. Why are you so hard-headed? Do you want to die that badly? You just said your mom's still alive, right? Shouldn't you be at her side then? You know she must be worried sick about you! You don't... Huh? You don't know anything about me! What? And yet you come waltzing in like you know everything! talking about? <laughs> I said, what are you talking about? <gasps> what the? Who are you? Don't try to stop the sacrifice. This is...
What good is staring so hard at that branch gonna do? This is not going to work. Hey! Don't follow me. Wait! Don't give up your life for this! There must be a way to save the village without having to offer you up as a sacrifice! I'm not thinking of being a sacrifice at all. Huh? Mother... Hey! Just wait up for a second! as far as you go. What? What's this? I'll take this wall down with my Rasengan! I know. I'll definitely stop her this time. I swear I will. There's no way this little wall is gonna stop me. You think I'm gonna give up this easily? Beads are glowing. That means... Eventually, they'll turn red to signify the end of the dream. When they glow red, come find me. I'll take them off. And once the weight comes off, Glowing red. That means my training is complete. If I get Pervy Sage to take these beads off, I'll be able to break down this wall easy. All right, now to get back to Pervy Sage. Uh. Hmm. This is the branch that girl was staring at earlier. It's not going to work. Maybe I should get Pervy Sage to check out this branch while I'm back there, too. Wait for me. I'll be right back. Pervy Sage! Oh, you're back just in time. Sage, look at this! This means my training is complete, right? Hurry up and take these things off! Okay, but before that, I need you to help me out with an urgent task. Huh? But I'm in a hurry, too! Just listen. This involves that girl from the ritual, too. Don't worry. It's... it's about her, too? What are you talking about? You remember that young woman we met before you went into the cave, right? Young woman? Uh... It's a ritual. A human sacrifice. There is no other way. <laughs> oh yeah! That lady with the cold and the lucky charm around her neck, right? Yes, I want you to find her. Her? Why? I'll explain later. Just go find her as quickly as you can. Understood. Don't worry, Pervy Sage. I'm on it. You search inside the village. I'll go look around the outskirts. Okay. I guess I'll talk to some of the locals and gather some information. Hey, remember me? You're that boy I met at the village. <coughs> Tsubaki, that's your name, right? Yes, but how do you know my name? That's not all I know. I heard a lot about you from the villagers. About me? 
how you're descended from the people who lived in these parts a long time ago. And about your illness, it's difficult to cure. Hmm, you really did your homework, kid. Hervey Sage! I found this on the ground in that cave. I think it might tie into your theory. It's... this is... a withered branch of the Tree of Life. You can tell that just by looking? Hmm. Well, it's in your blood, I suppose. This must mean that Black Shadow is using the power of the Tree of Life. Which proves they must be related, right? Hmm. I think you're probably right, Naruto. Wait, so that means that she's trying to... The Tree of Life is inside Black Shadow. So Aoi entered the cave to get some leaves from that tree. This much we know. All this, so she could cure her mother. I wanted to spend my last days with her. She was the only joy I had left anymore. But Aoi, she wants you to spend all your days with her. That would be the real joy. Anyway. Huh? Release! Whoa! My body's really light! Go, Naruto, and bring her back with you, no matter what. <laughs> no problem! <coughs> Tsubaki! Oh no, the sickness is getting worse! <laughs> Hang in there. Naruto, hurry to Aoi as fast as you can. I'll stay here and take care of Tsubaki. Okay. Take good care of her, pervy sage. <laughs> Wait! Here! Take this. This was handed down in my family for generations. I know it will protect her. I got it. I'll make sure she gets it. I promise. Please, <coughs> take care of her. Please. This time... This time I'll definitely put an end to it! Wait for me, Aoi! Aoi! <sighs> oh, it's you again. But how do you know my name? I know more than that. I found out all about you. Like what? You looked into Black Shadow and the Tree of Life to save your mother. I also found out that you volunteered to be the latest sacrifice. <sighs> I heard a lot of stuff from a lot of people, and it finally all made sense. You're going after Black Shadow not as a sacrifice, but to save your mother. <sighs> Your mom, she was so worried about you. She kept asking me to save you. She cares about you so much. I thought I told you not to do anything too crazy. What? What do you expect me to do? I don't want my mom to die. I didn't know what else to do. She was totally fine up until recently, always smiling and laughing. Then, the sickness comes and tries to take her away from me. You expect me to just sit and watch as she slowly leaves me? Because I can't do that! I already lost my father. I don't want to lose my mother, too. I... Aoi. I love her. I love her with all my heart. I want to be with her forever. I want to be by her. That's why... <laughs> Look, 
Everyone knows exactly how you feel. But you don't have to sacrifice yourself for this. this far. Just leave the rest up to me. But why? Why would you do all this for someone you don't even know? Huh? <laughs> I just wanted to see you and your mom smiling together again. Me and my mom together? Yeah. Yeah, by the way, your mom told me to give you this. This is the charm my mom always wore. She said it would protect you. Hold on to it, and wait for me here. I'll get those leads for you, I promise. Thank you. Mom, just hold on. as far as you go. Why? 
Is there a flower petal in that charm? Oh no! Mom! Tree of Life long ago. No, no. Thank you. We can't throw away this opportunity. This opportunity that your ancestors and your mother helped create for us. I can't protect you right here. Right now, I'll never be able to protect anyone! What is this, human? This is our final battle, pal! Get ready! Finally decided to wake up, huh? Huh. Burby Sage. How long was I out for, anyway? Hmm. About a week, I think. Whoa. I've never slept that long before. <laughs> I guess even you were pretty tired after all of that. Ah! What? Don't scream like that! H how's Howie? And her mom, is she all right? What happened to the two of them? Ah, uh, yes, well... 
I can't just sit around here. I'll be back later, Pervy Sage. <sighs> the only time he's ever at ease is when he's asleep. Covered. I'm relieved. What's wrong? Um, uh, yeah, I was just wondering where your mom was. She's all better now, right? She... What's wrong? Well, you see... Naruto, are you sure you should be up and about already? <laughs> hmm? What's wrong? You look like you've just seen a ghost. Uh, Mom, you're out walking again! Oh, shouldn't I be? Mom, even though the Tree of Life's medicine worked, you're still recovering. Okay, okay. It's just so boring not being able to get out and about. Mom, you never listen to me. You look surprised. Huh? Uh, yeah, no, it's just... Aoi was acting all weird, so I guess I thought... <laughs> Don't worry. That's not a spirit or a ghost or anything. She's fine. Thanks to you, Aoi, and the Tree of Life, she's well on her way to recover. Although, it was a close call. <laughs> What's gotten into you, Naruto? <laughs> I'm just happy, that's all. You and your mom, together, healthy. I'm really happy everything worked out. Naruto... I can't thank you enough, Naruto. For saving me, and for saving Aoi. <laughs> no problem at all. I'm the one who should be thanking you. Hmm? Why is that? It doesn't matter how tough things are. If you never give up, your wishes will come true. When I saw how determined you were, it gave me the strength to stop that monster. Well, I guess we should be moving on. Huh? What? Do you really have to leave already? Wait, before you go, let me give you something to show you our gratitude. That's okay. We can do that next time. Oh, come on, Pervy Sage. Let's relax here for a little while longer. My goal is to make you stronger. We don't have time to relax. Or do you not want to get any stronger, hmm? Got it. <laughs> Good to know we're on the same page. Well, we'll be stopping by again sometime, I'm sure. Thanks again for everything. Take care. Oh, man. I don't see why we can't hang out here a little longer. Are you leaving? Yeah, I've got a lot of training to do. He's right. We have to get moving. It's okay, though. We'll be back. Promise? You can't break a promise, you know. You got it. All right, then. Take care, you two. You too, Naruto. Don't forget about our promise. Thanks. Let's get to training! <laughs> 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 